hey guys welcome back to another video so today's review is going to be by a company by the name of hair vv this is my first time working with them all so hair vv sent me two bangs to review and also a natural wavy wig and this wig is going to be 18 inches 150 percent density and a medium cap this wig may scalp like cap that is sewn in underneath and so i understand the controversy about like the controversy that's going on around YouTube about this particular method. And so before I did not know about this until I started researching and I didn't know that it was a big issue. And so we are already I am already under contract and basically I am going to review this wig due to me already being under contract. And so I actually did this method. This method was created by Miss Precious Marie. She did, in fact, create one video sewing down the stocking cap, and then she created another video using the Gasta B free spray. I did actually, if you look up in the corner, I made a video doing the free spray method, and that came out perfect. Unfortunately, before, I did not realize that it was just so much drama that basically went around with this and you know look before anybody trying to come for me or trying to come say something in the comments i was not well aware of how big the drama had gotten but like i said i am going to review this wig and so here i am using the straps and i am showing you all this is going to be a glueless method on this first attempt number one because I am going to be showing you all me doing a glueless and then I'm going to be showing you all me using the $5 bangs. And so I am going to be um, just putting a few curls in here and here I'm showing you that I did not receive any shedding with this wig. Now this wig texture was kind of rough um i want to say that it is maybe a brazilian i will leave it it has to be a brazilian because this texture really did feel um like a rough like a coarse texture as far as coming to brazilian like we all know indian and malaysian feels silky so i am betting that this is going to be a brazilian texture this did also come with a smell it is not a corn chip smell but it is a smell that comes with the wig and so other than that i did not receive any tangling i did not receive any shedding i did as far um like the plucking method i feel as though is that it could be plucked just a little bit more but if someone who is a beginner wig wearer i would definitely recommend this for them because i feel as though is that people who are just getting into wigs should not get wigs that are like plucked like to the gods be because hair tends to shed and so that is going to sometimes create a bald spot and someone who has is new at wearing wigs might not know that and they might not be experienced on not to like tug too hard or you know how it is comb too hard tug too hard brush too hard but anyways and so um the density on this wig being 150 percent i definitely agree this definitely is a 150 percent wig and so um the only thing that i kind of really had about the wig while wearing around for a couple of days was just the smell i did not wash this wig before so um i am not currently sure if the smell washes out i probably will wash it at the end of doing the voiceover on this video just to see if the smell will wash out and i will definitely leave that on the screen if it did or did not and so other than that i really love the pre-made um stocking cap but like i said all glory goes to miss precious marie i will definitely try to link her video below if i can't link her video below then i will definitely link her name that you can just type her name into youtube search engine and you will be able to pull up that video because i've never linked somebody else's video before underneath so i don't i'm not sure how to do it so anyways um yes yeah, so this wig right here is definitely a um game changer for new wig beginners um you also can use my code i will leave that down in the description box below and i am i do i like this this is very actually a very nice wig and so here i did glue down the sides in order to pull this back into a ponytail and so um now, when I did decide to do to use the light wispy bangs because I felt like the thick bangs was just too much, I can I do think that you can um use this in a updo 
And you can also use this like updo or just it being worn down. And as bangs, I decided to do a ponytail because the updo was just going to be too much. Um, I decided to do a ponytail and then just go ahead and then snap it on. Now, it doesn't actually like snap snap. You have to like tug to one side, put the hair in and tug the other side and put it in. Now, <laughs> I really wish I would have brushed the rest of that hair back and not had left that middle part. But honestly, I was not going anywhere. And so I feel as though if you do that, it would blend in more and you would not be able to see that line of demarcation because you're able to see the long middle part. And if I have not said already, this is going to be a 5.5 inch. And um, they also have a six inch available. But to me, this really do look like a six inch, but it's a 5.5 inch. And so I definitely like the bangs. Definitely going to wear these bangs when I go out to Atlanta. Yes, honey, I am. <laughs> these little five dollar clip on bangs is bomb. And so make sure you check that out also in the description box. And I will have that link for the five dollar bangs below. Thanks for tuning in and watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, make sure you leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, loves.